一九九零年，一个未来无可限量的二十三岁大学篮球员汉克·盖瑟斯，在完成一个空接灌篮后，颓然倒下，从此没再起身。死因是肥厚型心肌症，一种先天性的遗传病。而现在，这种与生俱来的诅咒终于迎来曙光。美国俄勒冈州波特兰市，一个宜人居住不算特别大的城市，在这里，一个平凡的实验室有了不平凡的成就。他，舒克拉·米塔利波夫所领导的团队，借由基因编辑工具 CRISPR-Cas9 发现遗传病的出路，踏出了基因工程与生计医疗的一大步。Uh, well, I think we've done, you know, pretty big step towards it, and we've been actually pioneers in that field. 人的基因大概有两万到两万五千个基因，单基因突变可以引起的疾病大概占了可能将近有一万个左右。所以临床上来说，目前对遗传性的疾病只能是减轻缓解症状，但是目前没有办法能够防止。这个基因不可以传到下一代去。I think、uh, genetic diseases are a little bit different because you have to treat them with genetic tools. 从基因开始的错误就必须从基因下手。米塔利波夫团队征求到一位带有肥厚型心肌症变异基因的捐精者，以及十二位健康的卵子捐赠者。历经三年研究，在五十八个受精胚胎中成功修复四十二个。Yeah, I think it was a big surprise because.、Um, We were hoping that、uh, you know the, sometimes embryos repair themselves normally, but it usually happens in very very low cases. But I think、uh, what we found is very high high percentage of repair, so the efficacy is very high, and that kind of needs to be of course reproduced. If this is the case, then it probably has more implications, not just for embryo gene repair. Maybe it's in cancer gene repair. 自基因编辑工具 CRISPR-Cas9 问世以来，尝试剪除变异基因的研究从未少过，却从来没有达到如此高的修复率。So because you know the embryo would contain two copies of every gene for most of the gene, we designed CRISPR to target only mutant gene, but they wouldn't cut the the other copy, and that's how our design was a little bit different, and that's why. I guess when you have another copy of a parental gene which is not cut, not damaged by CRISPR, so that gene seems like by default、uh, allows itself to use as a template, to re- basically as as a blueprint to do repair. So that's、um, the difference in our experimental design, and and that's how we found this very unique ability of for the embryos to do self repair. So that was kind of the, you know, the, our finding,、um, and then many, you know, other investigators before missed it because they would cut both copies, and when you damage both, then there is no, there is no blueprint to repair. 惊人的发现轰动了全球，然而这一切只是开端。但是的话，还有很多很多工作要做，呀，这才刚刚开始。第一，我们自己也想核实一下，如果要是其他的基因突变，是不是还是同样这样的修复基因？第二，我们也想能不能把这个效率、有效性更提高一点。我们现在只是百分之七十二，还有一个，当然这是一个很 c h a l l e n g 的。要是病变是在 maternal 的 allele 上面的话，这样子的话，是不是那个精子的 copy 能不能作为修复的模板？ It still remains a very few day old、uh, embryo, and of course we cannot, you know, say for sure that now the baby would be fine and everything would be fine. So that that part is still ahead. We could do、uh, lots of with animals. So we could do in the mouse, of course, or in the monkeys.、Uh, we produce monkeys, and sometimes we study until they adults and we breed them.、Uh, but you're right; still has to be tested in humans. 未来的路还很长。
即使基因研究触及敏感道德伦理问题而受到层层阻碍，米塔利波夫从不停下脚步。他的梦很单纯。I think we want to make sure that the,、uh, we do this science not for sake of science. We believe、uh, you know, future will come.、Uh, not sure how, how, how soon, maybe five, ten years, when this technology will come to clinics and first gene repairs will occur. Many actually families、uh, want to. Participate in in clinical studies.、Uh, they they all are very sad, of course, because of the the they they know that、um, they have the disease because it happened either in them or in their children. The、uh, their ideas they they don't want this type of suffering to other families or to next child they might have.、Um, and we very much you know touched by these stories, and that's what makes us to. To stay strong, and despite the controversy,、uh, despite the, that we, we we get criticized for for doing embryo research, you know we we're working because of、uh, you know、uh, not to win prize, but to, to bring it to clinic. And the birth of child, healthy child, is is a better prize you know, than anything else.、Uh, if I wanna、uh, retire, when I say that this project already. Delivered was delivered to clinics. The children were healthy and born、uh, using this technology, and that's what probably is going to be most satisfying.